Right then guys, time to read some magazines. We love magazine fun. It's no baby. I was carrying a two stone whopper. I, I didn't realise that uh, Burger King were uh, doing two stone whoppers. I, I thought of it. it? No, don't think I will. Wicked stepdad forced me to dig my own grave. This is great. Oh, and then he turned on her little sister. Fantastic stuff. We've got some New Year money goals here. How to ace Christmas in 2024. So we're really planning ahead. Good on you. If your first thought is you never have enough money to spare, remember a negative mindset is bad, okay? So what you can do is you can reframe your thoughts and what it says is um, maybe you could sell some of the toys that you bought for your kids. Now, um, am I wrong or is that not what got you in the shit in the first place? Seriously. Oh, my God. Woo! <laughs> Bingo time. Don't forget about your bingo, because that is important. That is what gets everybody through life. Uh, they don't lose an absolute ton of money playing it. Basically, everybody's just walking around rich because they play this. this. Get the magazines. Right. Right then, guys. We've got dilemmas. Here we go. Um, home sweet home. Not. Um, I'm currently 34 and living with my dad. Um, I do pay rent, but there's a problem. His new partner is making big changes to our home and I don't feel like it's a place I want to be anymore. I think his partner's probably changing the locks, so it's actually not a place that you're allowed to be anymore. And quite rightly so, you're 34 years of age, so go and get yourself a job and get yourself a flat. How about that? Right, gift ideas. Anyone's birthday coming up? Well, it's got to be a male. So if you have a hubby that pisses his pants, this is for you. So um, you feel dry and confident all day long. Um, so the super absorbent men, un men's underwear, sorry, um, looks and fits like regular underwear, but with extra absorption. Sorry. It's a crazy world. We love this bit. Um, the Loch Ness Monster isn't the only mammoth beast hiding in our rivers. Eh? We know it's not because I've bloody well experienced it anyway firsthand. Uh, oh, and you want to go down to Bournemouth Beach in the summertime, you'll soon see plenty of these. Lovely. And now, here we go, guys. Find the cat! Find the cat! Yes, find a cat. Yes, yes, find a cat. Okay, so this time the um, you've got to find the cat um, in a page full of cows. And again, you will win fifty pounds for the privilege. Yes. Yes. Keeps happening. This is weekly. And by the way, please subscribe. I'm not done yet. Wait, we've got more fantastical things coming out. We have got. Oh, <laughs> this is this is good. Oh, whore comes the bride. Love these headlines. Um, and apparently, um, this um, lady's. This, God, I always say this, but use that in the loosest possible term. Um, this uh, woman, whatever, um, was snubbed by her mother because her mother thought, thought that her wedding dress. Um, made her look like a prostitute. Well, well done, mother. You were quite right. It's, it's such a shame that I can't show you these pictures, but I think you'd all agree with me. There we go. Bit, bit more New Year cheer. Um, the nursery teacher addicted to sex with children. Brilliant. Now, I shouldn't joke about this. And I'm not really. I'm just being pretty honest. Um, this... Um, woman has written in saying paralysis won't hold me back now she's paralyzed from the neck down so I think you'll find it will my love but good on you for be able being able to write into this in the first place Pretty well done and I hope you have a nice life 
someone up pissing their pants there seems to be a thing going on here right then guys we're now down to well it's ask somebody so let's call it ask holly right am i right to be worried about love letters i don't know the answer to this um, I recently discovered old love letters from my partner's ex-girlfriend from over two years ago. They dated for about six months, I believe. I don't care about him still having them. We all keep memories from the past, but I discovered them in our sex drawer. A, se a sex drawer. Now, I'm, I'm actually not going to give you too much advice other than um, stop being quite so foul who actually has a sex draw. Yes, so we have another one where we've got family massacred, hubby slaughtered them all, even the dogs. We are still going into a new year with an absolute bloody triumph. Don't know what's going on with everyone, but there we go. <laughs> advice here um so we've got socks um if you, if you, if you buy two you get one free <laughs> this is this is safe for the isle of Wight. what's what's that what? the extra foot could be west virginia who knows i've got a bonus for you guys this is an extra present tip we definitely have a common theme going on here. And I don't know what's going on with people in the world, but it, it would seem that everybody... <laughs> everybody's pissing their pounds. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, so save pounds with super absorbent, discreet and washable panty liners. Yes, um, so these soft panty liners um, oh, they're eco-friendly. Um, they're money-saving way to manage daily light leaks. <laughs> Just go to the toilet, you lazy bastards. Now, don't be forgetting to like, subscribe, it's free. And also comment, it's absolutely brilliant. Thank you.